Yeah, we're okay. Do you save people? Yeah, that's what we're doing. Is that what you're doing? Yeah, we're yes, lifesavers. And how did you become lifesavers? Uh, I started off as, uh, as a hobby at school, competing uh, at the swimming pool. Then it became uh, surfing, then we got introduced to life saving. That's how we started. So you guys used to surf? Yeah, we are surfing. Oh, you are surfing, yeah. so you still love your surfing? Yeah, there's yeah. nothing we can't do in the water, like uh, many boards, uh, ski, surfing, like and, everything. And where do you surf? We surf here, uh, Battery Beach, Wedge Beach, wherever we be comfortable surfing. We surf. uh, Brilliant. So you love you love to surf, though. Eh? Yeah. Okay, better than life saving. We can't say it's better. We can't say it's better because yeah, you're saving lives. It's the same. Yeah. And then when you're surfing, like personally, so you enjoy yourself. It looks like a real cool life, yeah. Yeah. As a life saver, just parking off, watching the. When somebody drowns, then you got to go and run out there, right? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's Have you guys had to do that a lot? Yes. Yeah, like every weekend. Every weekend yeah. you save a person. Yeah. yeah. Wonderful. Usually, uh, when, when, when schools are closed, uh, like holidays, uh, usually that's when uh, the job gets tough. Okay. All right, brilliant. Thanks, man. Do you want to say hello to anybody, your family members, friends, uh, girlfriends? Uh, what about all the girls out there? What about all the chicks? Don't you want to say hello to the chicks out there? <laughs> hey, because the chicks love life oh, lifeguards and even surfers. Yeah. Say hello to all the chicks. Yeah. Uh, Saving club. Uh, please uh, give me some information on, on the life saving uh, scene at the moment. Well, yeah, we've, Anyone um, we've just had SA Surf Life Saving Champs. Uh, okay, yeah, we great. We yeah. uh, Battery Beach where um, the club finished in first place. Uh, first time in our, our 50 year history. Wow. Yeah, so at the moment we're on a big high, personally. And this is this is a one club. Yeah. There's a few clubs. There's one in North Beach and all that sort of thing. Yeah. You guys competitive? Sorry. Yes, no, we are very competitive. Um, obviously, you've got Durban Surf at North Beach. You've got Pirates at Sun Coast uh, Beach, Battery Beach, and then Schlanger Rocks and Schlanger. Those are your main big clubs in Durban. Um, and we are we're very competitive with each other. And as Stuart said, we just had our national champs. Yes. And uh, yeah, I mean. The seniors went down to the wire where we beat Durban Surf by six points. So wow. Very, very close. And uh, now we all get on. We Obviously, our biggest thing is that we provide a service to, to the community. Our members do duties or patrols on the beaches on, on Saturdays, Sundays, and public holidays. So that's the other aspect to it, as, apart from competing and, and the fun part. Um, I wanted to ask you, Tra Trevor and Stuart, you guys obviously lifesavers yourselves from when you were kids and grew up in the scene. Has it changed over the years or is it still pretty much similar to what it was when you guys were? From the competition and the patrol perspective, it has changed a lot. Um, it used to be very much a, a guy sport. Um, only in the last 10 to 15 years have um, females become very involved, okay. both, both in patrols and in competition. And they now make up a very good part of the, of the movement. And that's good, that. I mean, that's, that's progress. That's, I mean, uh, ladies getting involved. That's why I see a lot of ladies surfers too. That's why uh, it's changed. Um, any, I just want you to say hello to, to, to the people that want to come and uh, be a lifesaver. How, do, how, do you, you, how old do you have to be? Okay, well, Sorry. basically, we, we start uh, at Nippers. Okay. okay. Um, we have a, a, a little section called Nipplets, which is kids under the age of eight. And then Nippers starts from eight years old up to uh, 13 years old um, and they normally train on a Sunday in season and um, it's a lot of fun for the kids it's a good lifestyle for them you know they're on the beach on Sundays uh, learning how to uh, how to swim in the sea and learning about the ocean 
Um, and then our juniors start at 14, and they go up to 18 years old. And then from that, we have a senior section, which is obviously the adults over 19 or over 18. And then um, we've got masters as well, which is all the bullies. When you turn 30, you become a master. You become a bully at 30? At 30, you become Jeez. a bully. And, and yeah, it's, Some it's of us cool. later. But... Okay, <laughs> yeah, none of us become bullies later at 30. <laughs> Righty, baby. Yeah. Maybe at 60, eh? But, uh, it's, it, it's, it's quite a unique movement in that it's not just a sport, um, you've got your patrol side of it and you've got your sports side of it. Okay. So, um, for the kids coming in at local level, they've got courses they have to, have to do, there's a level 1, 2 and 3, where they start off by learning basic um, beach skills. Uh, basic first aid, so it's very much a life skill that they learn. It's not just a sport like any other sport, you know? um, And in that life skill they're learning about the sea, uh, water safety, sun safety, and yeah, we've had uh, young kids of under the age of 12 that have, have successfully um, saved lives, and so, so it's a real life skill. And wow. That's the beauty of it. Thank you, Stuart. I'm a, so uh, you say life saving rocks. Absolutely. Is it rocks, Stuart? Yeah. Does it rock, Trevor? Okay, <laughs> let's say it rocks, right. Okay, get you guys down here, all the families, bring it, bring your kids down here, families, come and come and join uh, Trevor and uh, Stuart in the life saving. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.